back at Manuka on a pyramid prom point project. This is a three bedroom. Three bedroom to the back. You can see these railings. So you can actually go on the roof, chill out, and you have the staircase included. Right. So for us now, we're actually at the two bedroom. The two bedroom doesn't have this option right now. However, if you have a two bedroom and you want to add it in, of course, pay the extra and it's done for you. I've I'm saying all of that to show you this. We're gonna put in our solar air conditioning unit. However, there's no staircase to go up to get it up. There's a unit on top, the unit that was in before us. We're gonna take that down and we're also gonna take this one up there. So another day at Pyramid Point in Manuka on a Manuka project and we're going to be covering that carport. So the carport is going to be sealed, it's going to be protected, it's going to be providing two functions. One, shading, so you can play a domino underneath your soda panels and two, it's going to be providing power for our solar hybrid air conditioning unit. Another unit in action. So, all right guys, what's up? We're in Beverly Hills. We have another one of our Zamna climates. This is the 18,000 BTU. In my last video, I showed you the 12,000 BTU that I have set up on my home. So this customer has the 18,000. It's connected. As you can see, there are the cables. I'm not sure why they use two red but all the way up to the roof so right here and it goes to the roof and those go right back to the solar panels so we're gonna check on the inside see how well it's cooling so here we are with the indoor section it's cooling as effectively as it can and if you should look all green, all green, and that means it's working on the solar panels. You know, there are actually six solar panels on the roof, each 335 watts, so that's going to give it about uh, 2,000 watts. So it's getting 2,000 watts from those six solar panels, which is more than enough because the unit itself, the 18,000, needs 1390 watts to operate as always i want to show you guys this so there's a condensation remember this is working only off six solar panels there's a condensation for you there's your drain as much water as possible and here's what we've done as well we've added some more sticker so you see here is on the climate what we've added solar air conditioning sticker and 100 free ac during sunlight so now we're going to be moving down to Ocherius. we're going to be checking on the unit at pyramid point to see how that one is doing for that setup what we did was to cover the carport with five solar panels. Those panels are 405 watts. But when we get there, we're gonna show you. We're in Ocherius now. We're at Pyramid Point. And right here is a carport. What we've done with this carport is to 
cover with solar panels. So we're going to be covering the entire unit. You see, section is partially covered. But what these five solar panels are doing right now is providing power to our 18,000 solar powered split unit that's on the roof. This is what we did. So we sealed between each solar panel and not just tape, but in between there is a T rubber seal. We use EPDM rubber and that seal between the panels so that no water is able to pass through. So now this provides shade and it's providing power for AC unit. So what I'm gonna do, in the event you don't know permit point houses, I'm gonna do a quick tour so that you can see what it is like. This is the two bedroom unit. This is the outside, what it looks like. And as we walk to the interior, we're first gonna enter the living room, dining room area. It's an open concept. As we enter here, there's your powder room. And next to the powder room, you have your kitchen. We have our mini split on the inside. This is providing the coolness to the dining room, the living room, the dining room, the living room, and the kitchen area. And it's on 16 degrees Celsius, which is the coldest. And also it's green. And green meaning that it's getting all the power from the solar panels. Those five solar panels that are now covering the carport, they have three more to place so that it can be covered completely. But this green indicates that hey, this unit is getting all the power from those solar panels. They are 405 watts. 405 watts and they are effectively providing all the energy that this um, this device now needs it's cool right now and let me show you on the outside I'm gonna show you the rooms but let me show you the outside the sky is like this right now it's pretty overcast at the moment it's pretty overcast on that side it's good. the sun is behind those clouds but we're still we're still getting enough power to keep the unit running off solar power only. We're on the roof now. So yes, we partially covered the carport. We have this section to so add three more solar panels and it will be fully covered. And all this is now providing power to our mini split, to our 18,000 mini split right here. So you can see the red and black cables and these terminate right into the MC4 connectors on this unit. So here, don't worry about this, we're gonna be changing this and placing it horizontal. But yeah, everything is coming from the solar panels and terminating into the outdoor compressor. There you have it. So of course, if you don't have a solar powered air conditioning unit, you can have your carport covered for something like the charging network for your EV, or you can use it to provide power to your home. You can cover the carport, have it providing shading and also power to your home. So, yep, there you have it guys. There you have it. Model house. Let's check out the sticker 100% free AC during sunlight because that's what 
the air condition does once there's sufficient sunlight then you don't have to worry about you know getting power from the grid and in our case i'm talking jps you won't have to worry about the grid supplying the unit with power it will be the solar panels that handles that during daytime so of course we check out our sticker 100 free ac during sunlight and of course our flyer when you enter there's going to be a flyer here that says Zamna Solutions. Pick one up. On the back, you'll have added information. You can read, you can get to know more about the unit. 